Hello there and welcome back to my workshop. So today I'm going to show you how to machine that well-known picture into uh, a piece of wood. Okay, so now I'm going to solve another mystery for you, and that is, I've just changed the tool, and a lot of people ask me, well, how do you find the new zero of the new tool? Or how do you zero a new tool when you change it? Well, it's fairly easy. Uh, it's exactly the same operation as what you do with uh, the first tool, except you you may have to find a different area that's not been cut. All right, so here's a perfect example. Because this is flat material, and the bed's flat, I could zero it off here, 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 anywhere that hasn't been machined. So we'll just do it off this surface here. So we'll just take it back a little, over a little, and then we'll get a bit of paper and it's the same operation I can catch out of the paper and do this same operation just move the paper till it just grabs there. It's just got it. So now we can zero the new Z position. So to zero the new Z position it's just press this and then we bring this down to Z okay and so that's the new Z zero. Come out of that and now we're going to select the new file which 
is this one, cut number two. It's a two millimeter ball mill. Uh, it's actually a tapered ball mill. And open that file. And we can check to see, yeah, it's a different file. It's the one we require. And escape out of that. So it's reading directly from the memory stick. So we'll just lift that up a little. And uh, we'll put that in the roughly in the right position and we'll run this file. is a top quality, beautiful 3D relief. It's a well-known scene from the Second World War. And the MIDI CNC router did that perfectly in conjunction with the SMC controller. 
very pleased with the MIDI CNC rotor. Incidentally, all the drawings, specifications, and where to purchase parts from, and the pricing is available on my Patreon pages. If you've liked this video, please press like and subscribe. Incidentally, I will tell you, I built this whole unit, including the electronic system and the SMC controller, for less than a thousand dollars. So it can be done, and it can turn out perfect 3D carvings. So I hope you've enjoyed the video today. Please press like and subscribe. And, well, until the next video, thank you for watching, and it's bye for now.